Here on my channel, it's currently raining. Yes. What's up? So today is a my favorites video. And if you guys have been watching my channel for a while, you know I've only done like one favorites video, which was like, it was back when I was using my phone and it was attached to my bunk bed. So <sighs> delete that out of your mind. Anyways, I'm going to do a made favorites for you, but I want you guys to know something right now. I'm not going to be doing like May favorites, June favorites, July favorites, like every single month because to me, I don't go out and buy like 50,000 different products and say, okay, these 40 are my favorite for the month. I don't go out and buy products every single month, so I can't keep up and tell you, oh, this was my favorite for the month because I'd be lying to you. I know I'd be lying. And sometimes I think like... Who goes out and buys products every single month and like says, oh, this is my product for the month. Like who has the money to do that? I know. These products that I'm about to show you are products that I've bought over probably the last like three months. And that's, and even then I don't even have that many products at that. So to sum it up, I'm not going to be doing favorites every single month. I will probably do favorites like every three months probably so I'll have like four different favorites videos for a year cuz I'm not I don't I'm not balling like that I can't buy a whole bunch of different products every single month and tell you these are my favorites so let's get started the first product I'm showing you is EOS this so freaking good you just don't know. You have to buy this because it has shea butter in it, which is very moisturizing for your luscious lips. And if you don't know, regular chapstick has alcohol in it, and alcohol is very addicting, if you did not know. And it actually dries your lips out, and you just have to keep reapplying it and reapplying it until it's gone, and then you have to buy some more. So that's how they get you with regular chapsticks, because I used to think, oh, things have to get worse before they get better. And so I was like, well, my lips, they're getting dry because they're about to get better. Like, this is the worst part of it. They just have to get used to being, uh, what's it called? I don't know, plump and like moisturized. That's what I'm looking for. They just have to be used to being moisturized. That's why they're so dry right now. But no, that is not the thing. If anything, you'd be better off using Vaseline than some regular chapstick. But you don't want to use Vaseline. You want to use EOS. So yes, this is good, and I'm gonna pull a GG. Mm. So next is this Prime Time by Bare Minerals, and this is for oil control, which is very good because I have very oily skin. I didn't even have very oily skin when I lived in Kansas, but I live in the south now, and it's humid here, and I literally look like, after an hour of putting makeup on, it looks like someone took a bucket of oil and just went, <sighs> and rubbed it on my face I look nasty like I've been sweating or something so this is just a portion of how I help like maintain non oily skin when I have makeup on so this is good this is real good you just pump it and it's good get it so keeping on the trend with oily skin we are going to talk about these right here these bad boys oil blotting tissues and let me tell you these are the bomb this is by Hollywood fashion secrets and I'm just gonna read the back because I've never read the description on this I just bought them because they were oil blotting tissues it says a grapping sweat inspired it all grapping gaping oh my god it says a gaping sweat inspired it all. Hollywood fashion tape. Now your fashion fairy godmothers, Marnie and Jane, conceive and design magical solutions to help women feel confident and look fabulous at work, home, and play. Well, thank you, Marnie and Jane, for this because you know what? I'll just take one out right quick and show you. Just looks like this. Just one of these. And they're pink, they're cute, and you just, what I do is because I get it on my nose and under my chin, all I do is do it like one of those Bior strips and I just place it on my nose and tap it, and I place it on my chin and tap it like that, and that's it. And then you just, and you throw it away, you don't throw it on your bed. I just bought these from Steinmart, you know, when they set all that stuff in the aisle when you're about to check out, so you can just grab it like, oh, I need that, I need that, I need that. That's what one of these were. 
one of those I need that so I grabbed it right before we checked out and it was 99 cents so buy this I got my mom one too okay so keeping on the trend with oily skin because you know misery loves company and oil loves me clean and clear right here this is a new one it is the advantage oil absorbing cream cleanser and this is this Washes off 85% of oil buildup and it keeps the shine away all day. So yeah, and it helps prevent breakouts and treats them as well. Buy this stuff because it's good. It is just like a white, if you can see that, kind of see like the crusty crustiness of the inside that I have. That's what it looks like. It just looks like white chalk. And I just put it on the sides of my nose, under my chin, and on my forehead because that's where I get oily. Leave it on 15 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour. It's all the same. However long you can leave it on, you leave it on for. And I do this in the morning. You can do it at night if you want to. And then you just wipe it off with water, like wash it off with some water. It also has oil bees in it, so that's good. So like you're getting a scrub at the same time. It's sucking up all the oil and you can get a scrub at the same time. So buy it. Walgreens, Walmart, Kmart, CVS. It really doesn't matter. Just buy it. Like, it's good. Still on the same ish. Oily skin. I'm telling you guys. Like, I had a problem and it was horrible. We're not moving. We're not talking about the oily skin on my face anymore. We're talking about it on my back. Mmm. Yeah. So I had. Before I show you my product, let me tell you. I had oily skin on my back. Like, it's like oil mixed with pimples and I'm not talking about like whiteheads or like um just like bumps not cystic acne it was like just nasty like I don't even know what they were they were like kind of like crusty pimples on the middle in the middle of my spine on my back so I was like man I cannot do this I can't have like scars on my back because just no no and it's about to be summer I can't like wear like a backless shirt and like be like mmm shiny so I was like, gotta do something. Neutrogena Body Clear Body Scrub. Yeah, this is what I got. It treats and helps prevent body breakouts for smooth and clear skin. This is Cicillic Acid Acne Treatment. This stuff worked like a charm. I bought this, I don't know, like a few months ago and I've been using it and it has helped my back like no other like I don't even have like that stuff anymore like I get oily back a little bit but not as much as I usually do and so just use this in the shower it has the beads in it where it's like scrubby beads so it just really works so I suggest you buy this like I said Walgreens Kmart Walmart CVS like wherever so going along with that Neutrogena body scrub is the Neutrogena body spray oh my god and this stuff is bomb.com this is what you use after you use the scrub so you scrub in the shower you get out you dry off you can use this I use this after I get out of the shower and I use this in the morning before I like put my clothes on and stuff and I spray it on my back and what's good about this is it's new it has a 360 spray and what that means is spray it like this you can spray it like this you can even spray it like this and why I'm saying spray it like this like what I'm gonna go like this and spray myself no I mean this oh I have something on my back let me spray it that's 360 for you that's cool so I recommend this highly like if you have breakouts on your back buy this buy this and the scrub the body spray and scrub it's good okay okay so I'm tired of talking about oily skin so we're gonna push that subject to the side and talk about something else um, Neutrogena still, I mean, but we're not talking about oily skin. This is eye makeup remover lotion. And this is just the three ounce one. It's a small bottle. It's new as well, a new product. This is the hydrating, which I don't know why I got hydrating. I have oily skin. I don't need hydration. I need like dehydration, if anything. But this gently removes makeup, and you can even use it for, um, Mascara. Mascara, yeah. Mascara. Waterproof and everything. And I got this because, like, I hate, first of all, wipes waste. So you can use this before you use wipes. This is a good thing. You break down the makeup, get as much off as you can, then use a wipe to just, like, go and get what you missed. And you don't have to, like, take a little bit and be like, oh, I don't want to get it inside of my eye. Like, I'm scared. Like, no, you can take a glob and, like, 
go at it like you're scrubbing anything because it's, I don't know, it conditions and soothes eye areas. So that's what it does. It does not burn your eyes when you get it inside there. I mean, it may like be like, ah, oh, it kind of stings a little bit, but you're not like, oh, that water, water, water. Like, it's easy. So yeah, Walmart, Kmart, CVS, Walgreens, anywhere. You can get it, like drugstore. The only makeup product I have for you is this. NYC eyeliner duo and the reason this made it into my favorites video is because it's a duo exactly um I had been watching a lot of videos where girls were like I'm gonna put this white eyeliner under my eye just to brighten my eyes and open them up brighten my eyes and open them up I'm just like what what does that mean like what 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 but I bought it I've been using the cream very good it does make your eyes look like you're awake and black people you can use this too don't use I don't know about white I bought white but I haven't tried it yet I'm kind of like oh, no no my eyes are my skin's a little dark to be using white eyeliner to say that I'm waking myself up like I don't know but it really works and this is the reason I like this is because a lot of eyeliner is like like a pencil like literally like you're scratching yourself because it's so hard this stuff is creamy like it's real like it's real creamy like if you took your finger and just like went like this like that's when you know it's a good like tight line pencil so yeah this is good buy it Walgreens Walmart Kmart CVS drugstore mm. okay now I am moving away from all like product type stuff makeup body products any the cut type stuff like that this is like etc like etc um this water bottle yes it is glass that's one thing that i like about this is that it's glass because i feel like plastic water bottles kind of sometimes give off that nasty like plastic taste sometimes so i really like this i don't know what brand this is it doesn't have oh der quench that's all it says. It says quench and gray. I really love this. I got it from Walmart. It was, I don't know how much it cost. I couldn't tell you. But I got it because I like it because it's pink. And then also, first of all, it has just a lid on it. Second of all, it has, then it has this. Like this is what the lid is. It's just a hole. It's not something that you have to like suck out of. I used to have a camel bag because that was like the thing in my high school. Like if you don't have a camel bag, who are you? But Camelbacks, you can get mold in the little like gooey thing. Like mold can build up in that thing real quick. So that's something that I didn't like about it. And it was also plastic and I didn't like that as well. So this, this is good. I love it. But okay, it's not cute if you break this. So if you're someone who's really clumsy, don't buy this. Do not buy this if you're gonna drop it and then glasses ever because then everyone's gonna be looking at you like who are you to bring a glass bottle in here and then break it so that's my tip for me to you I'm not gonna throw this because my dog's behind me so yeah okay last thing hold on let me get it the last thing for my May favorites is this and it's a DIY and if you guys want me to do like a video on this Comment below and also like my video. This, if you can even see all of it, is a DIY jewelry like holder. And I'm not done with it, that's why I'm just holding it like this. It's supposed to go on the wall. This was just a plain cork board when I first bought it. Like this color right here, this little tan color, that's the cork board. It was just plain and it had a tan outline as well. Like. The same color as the cork board was the borders of this. All I did was go to Lowe's. I got some white paint, some black paint, and I got these different knobs, like these ones, the silver one, and then I got this hook knob, and then I have two other ones on the other side that you can't see probably. And all I did was screw them in. Paint first I painted it, screwed these in, and that's it. And now I can just hang it up. And this is really good if you don't want to get your jewelry like in a clump because I know I just had a bag and I just threw all my stuff in there, just threw everything in there and then I would have to dump it out all the time and be like, oh my god, where's that necklace? Find the necklace, it's in a big clump and you can't get it out. So this, it's very convenient. So if you guys want me to do a DIY on it, 
like this video. Okay, so that concludes my May favorites video. If you guys like this, make sure you give it a, oh, I'm always skeptical to do this, thumbs up, thumbs up, I don't, I don't know. Oh my God, I'm just gonna say this. I'm gonna take a chance and say, give it a thumbs up down here. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel because I want you to be a part of my family, my internet family, so we can be weird together. And also, be prepared for a cool video next Friday. If you want to see that cool video next Friday, you're going to have to subscribe. But until next Friday, bye-bye. Bye-bye.